There's the statue of Apollo and the altar. Chrysis will find a lot more than a helpless infant waiting for her. Must be getting close. Killing seems to run in your bloodline, almighty oh eagle bearer. Don't you dare speak of my family, snake. I still remember the night your mother brought me my child. The sad, pathetic thing, crying in the rain. Had I known then that Mirini had two children. But here you are. My family is complete. You let my mother believe her baby was dead. But he was. Oh, how she wept when his little heart stopped beating. But then I took care of him. Placed him on this very altar. Screamed for the gods to spare his life. And they listened. Where did my mother go that night? That weakling crawled to the hills of Corinth. The monger was supposed to deliver her back to me, but she can't hide forever. She will give us more children. What did you do with my brother? I saved his life by teaching him to suffer, to know pain so well that he would learn to welcome it like an old friend. And now he will teach all of the Greek world to know that pain. You tortured him? He was just a baby! I taught him to survive. This world is cruel. It demands strength or death. So I gave him strength. I'll run my... Saving that baby was the right thing to do. Chrysis's reign of terror must end. If what Chrysis said was true, Mirini believes my brother died. <laughs>
con Steve. Shout to you. I'll see you soon. Potter's house.
found him. Let's go. Kere, would you happen to have any Athenian armor in your shop? It's for the Ecclesia's burial. Timotheos can buy his father's armor back if he likes. Won't be cheap, though. What do you mean? The Ecclesia sold me his armor not too long ago. Timotheos said his father's armor was stolen. Well, I have it here and I'm no thief. I also have another set of Athenian armor. Not as nice, but it would do for the burial. I'll take both sets of armor. Here's the Athenian armor. Theocles' armor is upstairs. There you are. Do you have the armor I asked for? I have your father's armor, Timotheus. That's... that's great news! Where did you find it? I went to the merchant in town. The armor wasn't stolen, Timotheus. Your father sold it. That doesn't make any sense. My father wouldn't lie to me. What matters is you got the armor back. Thank you, Mistios, truly. You're welcome. Now I just need an offering of oil for the ceremony. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It means a lot. 
I should go dress my father. Mistios! Any news? I took care of the bandits, Chiquinos. Ah, I can breathe easier knowing my pater has been avenged. There's no chance those Malacas had any explanation for their heinous actions. Your father owed the bandit leader Ipatos quite a bit of rachmi. What business could he have had with that scum? What matters is that they paid for their crimes. Thank you, Cassandra. Now you can focus on mourning. I should probably let Timotheos know about this. If you're staying for the burial, I'm sure an offering of wine would mean a great deal to my pater. Timotheos asked me to pick up oil as well. Where can I find the offerings? He did? I mean, you should be able to find what we need at the docks. Let's hope no one notices me here. How could you be so stupid? More bloodshed, Likinos! Pater's death needed vengeance. I took care of it. You took care of it? You really think you will end there? Cassandra, you agree with me, right? Timotheus is right. Provoking the bandits was short-sighted. If I recall, you were less concerned when you were getting paid. Someone else's father probably just died because of you. Then it'll be your head next. You'd like that, wouldn't you? What? No, why would you say that? You've been nothing but cruel to me since I got here. I'm sorry, Likinos. I just don't want to lose you too. We only have each other now that Pater's gone. We should proceed with the burial. Did you find an offering?
there is Imaton. My dear Cassandra. I was hoping to have the chance to thank you for all you've done. What did you have in mind? Poet may be my day job, but there's more to me than that. I am also a very talented cook. Allow me to make you a fabulous meal. I'd like that. Great. There's just one thing. I'll need a little help hunting down some ingredients. Literally. You're treating me, you said? After all we've been through together, surely you can agree that I'm a lover, not a fighter. A lover, huh? We'll see. I hope so. What do you need me to hunt? This dish calls for venison. Any of the beasts wandering nearby should do. Meet me at the cliffs near the Ipernistra camp once you find some. I'll be on high alert here. Go now. Come on. Off we go now. That's a start. But Lekinos will need more. This should be plenty of meat for Lekinos' dinner. Don't ask any questions. Let's keep out of sight. Beautiful view. It certainly is. Did you manage to hunt down our food? Here's the meat. Perfect. I'll get stuck.
boat can't handle the waves out there. Cassandra, am I interrupting? This is where I used to practice sparring with my father. After he retired to the fishing business, he lost interest. No, at their father's house. It's pretty deep here. I should turn back. What happened here? This looks like one of the bandits that killed Diocles. Whoever did this didn't take anything. Likinos, are you all right? They took him! The bandits who killed my butter took Timotheus. Where did they go? To the ruins of Mikine. Please, you have to help him.
Timotheus, we have to get out of here. Timotheus? Where are they? Cursed Spartan dogs. Where are they hiding? You're safe, Timotheus. I promise. You! You're one of their spies! Timotheus! I'll... What are you doing? Likinos? I... I... I'm so sorry. I'm just glad you're all right. You saved us once again, mercenary. In more ways than one. The famed Eagle Bearer hasn't saved you just yet. It's nice to finally meet the Oclis' boys. And you must be the man responsible for my father's death. Responsible? Your father was one of my best smugglers before he screwed me over. Our father would never work for you. He had no choice. Dear the Oclis liked to gamble. With my support, he could place bad bets all day long and keep that lovely home of yours. Something tells me your support came with strings attached. Hardly. The Oclis and I were partners for years before I killed him. Unfortunately, a man who gambles with another man's drachmi stops being a gambler and turns into a thief. You got your payment in the Oclis's blood. What do you want with Likinos and Timotheus? The Oclis may be dead, but I haven't received my drachmi yet. You expect me to pay? One way or another, yes. Can't we come to a more peaceful arrangement? If the brothers can't pay, there's nothing left to discuss. What about you and me? You? Maybe there is something the Great Eagle Bearer could do for me. Well, what is it? There's a man in Corinth. He's my biggest competitor. I need him taken care of, publicly. Big guy, swears a lot. Can't make it five steps into Corinth without hearing about him. You mean the monger? Exactly. Oh, and Eagle Bearer. His death better be a bloody spectacle. Otherwise the debt goes unpaid. Thank you for saving me, Cassandra. There's something I've been meaning to tell you. I need to tell Cassandra something too. I'm sorry for running from you the other day. It wasn't how I really feel about you. I would never leave you. What I mean to say is I shouldn't have run from you when I want to be with you. I'm the only reason you even know each other. The fates have spoken. The gods brought us together. I feel it in the fiber of my soul. I want to be with you. I see. I'll leave you two alone then. The gods should envy me right now. Don't tempt them. 